Hello everybody and welcome to Blue Goose Garage. I'm out uh, doing a little bit of a road trip slash test drive in my van and while I'm up here in Kingsport I thought I would uh, tell you a little story. That up there, I don't know if you can see it through the trees that says Kingsport Speedway. And here's the sign down here. Back in the 60s and stuff, that used to be a NASCAR track, just like many other small tracks. It was a dirt track. Grandfather used to bring dad, his sisters, my cousin, everybody to a racetrack. He liked races. And this is one of the ones he used to go to. It was a dirt track back then. It's it's a concrete oval now, you know, it's nice, really it's a nice track. I'm, I'm showing you that to show you these pictures and then I'm gonna explain to you what the connection is. The first photo was PAL Sudden Service number one. And the second photo is PAL Sudden Service number two. It's a regional fast food chain. I think there's around 30 of them or so. But back in the 60s, when dad and everybody went to the races up here, the concession stand at Kingsport Speedway was a PAL Sudden Service. They had hot dogs, hamburgers, fries, and drinks. Um, I don't know what they do up there now. And that was just something that I wanted to show you. Some, I'll show you some these uh, signs. I ain't going up in there any further. Not in this big van, I'm not. I wanted to show you some signs before I left. You want to see where that is? If you don't know where it is, just... Uh, you can Google it. You can also Google Powell's Sudden Service if you want to. But you can see the track. It was closed for a number of years and I reckon it's back open on Friday nights now. Here in the summer. All right. Talking about the van now. Uh, I've put brakes on the front of it. By that I mean I put brake pads and hoses. I've fixed a handful of small water leaks that I had by changing the temperature sensors and the thermostat housing the thermostat. And uh, just all kinds of little stuff. This summer, I'm planning on going on a fairly long road trip. I'm not exactly sure on where and what yet. One of the options is, I'm, I'm thinking about, is the No Name Nationals YouTube thing. I wanted to go last year, but I didn't have the 500 subscribers yet. I do now, but I'm not gonna drive that Chevelle out there, so, I thought about just going out there in this van and, and you know, camping in the van for a couple of nights, maybe even entering it so I could say I did it, just drive the van down through there. It's doing good. All's well so far. My uh, temperature gauge seems to be running where it's supposed to be running, and uh, it's running as hot as it's supposed to be running now. and seems to be running better because the uh, sensor for the computer is good. The other one was kind of working, but it would occasionally flood when you went to crank it, which means that it was occasionally thinking that it was cold, so it wasn't getting a very good connection. But now it seems to be doing all right. I replaced the sensor and the plug, but uh, all's doing well. Anyway, I uh, hope you just enjoyed this. I know it's different than the normal video, but I'll see us again next time. And since I'm in the van, 
keep on vanning.